Hey guys, what's up? Kitty Pop here, and I am back with another face painting tutorial. I got another suggestion, and they suggested do a hamster. So that is what I'm going to do today. And what you're going to need is peach kind of skin-like color paint. You're going to need some white, and you're going to need some pink. Then for the brushes, you're only going to need two brushes. That's going to be the big one, which is featured in almost every single video. Then you also want to do a fluffy brush. It's wet right now, so it doesn't seem fluffy, but look how easy it can move. It can move really easy. It's really soft. So let's get right into this. Beforehand, I did this, did this, and it's the first time that I've ever used this. So there was this on it. A little cap to make sure that it didn't spill. So what you're gonna need is you want to take your white and your big brush, your big fluffy brush. That squeaking is the stool that I'm sitting on. That's why every time I move, even a little bit, it'll squeak. So, just, we're not gonna put it all over our face. I'm gonna look up, because if you haven't seen my videos before, there's a camera right above, um, not a camera, there's a phone right above, there's a mirror right above the camera. Well, phone, but. So what you wanna do, is not at the top, like in your mid forehead, and drag it down. But you want to get as close to the tip of the nose as you can, but not on the tip of the nose, because that we're going to do something. What you want to do now is you don't have to be exact with this because all hamster patterns are different. But this is the way that I practiced before, so. Then what you wanna do is you wanna do the same exact thing on the side. You don't have to make sure that it's even because it's a, a hamster pattern, so it's different. If you just heard that, it was, uh, the, my brush hitting the thing that it used to balance the foam. So basically you want to fill this in. Guys, you can skip this part if you want. I'm not saying you have to watch the whole thing. But there's a part on the nose that you might want to watch because we're not just going to leave a gap. That's why I'm not filling in right here. So basically you do like a few coats just to make sure that you, you don't have to make sure that your skin isn't showing, but just fill as much in as it, it fill it in as much as you can. So Guys, come on. So now that you've done that, what you want to do, you want to get some more of the white, paint your bottom lip. Try not to get any on your top lip because we're gonna put a completely different color. Try to get it as wide as you can. So that is as wide as I can get it. The reason why is because Hamsters do have bottom lips, but they're really hard to see. So, 
So what you want to do now, we're going to work on the nose area. That's so annoying. So annoying. I hate it. Ooh, I've got to put the cap on the white. Actually, we don't need the cap on the white. So take your fluffy brush and first paint your top lip. Then you don't want to paint your entire this area. You want to do like so. Watch very carefully. Um. On your ink. Basically kind of overline your lip a little bit, then connect it right there just a little bit. Then paint your nose. Uh, I'm keeping my mouth open kind of so that it doesn't combine. So let's just get that on your nose. The lighting in the bathroom is amazing. I love it. Guys, go follow me on Instagram. And I'll tell you what it is in the description. And go follow me on Musical.ly. It is Candy Sweet. Because can you have it taken? So you are done with the pink. So take your your gush, big brush again, and fill in the rest. So it's the this side. There we go. And then what you're gonna do, you do not need any or cause a chop one. There. So basically wipe off wipe off your big brush. You don't hard that something to show. So what I'm doing is I'm wiping off my big brush. So you wanna take your can Show up, but you have to do a few coats. It'll barely show up. See? See? Yeah. Oh, it'll barely show up. So now guys, try to do your eye. Here's why I said try it, because when I practice it, this night I got it all over my eyelashes. 
control. So now let's stir this. Oh, that's a lot. I don't know why I'm not talking. Why am I talking like that? Still. It's hard to show on camera, but that is oh, the light is shining. Hold on, let me do a quick double coat of the light. There you go guys, that is the finished look. It looks better in real life than it does on camera. But the problem I have about this face paint is that it fades, not fades, is that you can see the strokes like a lot. I think it might just be the brushes, but that's how I like the fluffy brushes because they don't show the strokes. So guys, that is the finished look. I hope you enjoy this video. <laughs> like subscribe comment down below what you would like to see next and i am still vote down vote in the comment se section below would you rather me do a bear next or a dragon next comment down below what that is but before we do that i'm going to take comments until we start getting the votes up and the vote will be done by the into this month, probably on my birthday, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Stay sweet.